So welcome to our session video. I'm Gaz from Rigmarole. Uh, I've come down to uh, Raysbury Complex. And we are going to be fishing Raysbury South Lake uh, for a couple of days. Uh, so a big thank you to RK for letting us on and do a bit of filming for them. Uh, throughout the video you will see there'll be a couple of the other Rigmarole lads come down. They'll give you a few demonstrations or just a, you know, a few rigs and the, and the way you use some of our products. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Here at Raysbury South, got a nice scaly one on the bank, just over 20 pounds. Pretty little fish. Caught on the rigmarole product, so skin full, just a multi rig. Lovely, pretty fish, just like all of them in here. There we go. Lovely, scaly, dark fish, clear water fish. Absolute banger. Hi there guys, just wanted to talk to you about a few different rigs and rig components that we've got in the range. Predominantly the Hydrolink um, as a hook length material, something that a lot of people probably know about. It's very, very, very different in terms of the fact it's a stiff and a supple um, hook length material all in one. In terms of the hook length material itself, it comes in a couple of different colours. I prefer the grey, um, generally because it blends into any bottom, as strange as it sounds. You can fish it over weed as it darkens down nicely, you can fish it over gravel, you can fish it over silt, and after probably 10 to 15 minutes in the water it tends to blend into almost anything. As you can see, I said it's stiff, it's got a 20 pound fluorocarbon, as it's inner and um, so you can hold it straight up off the spool and you can see how stiff that is i mean that will hold up i've got one for you here it will hold up a size four even a size two hook um, it's that stiff and all you have as i mentioned is a fluorocarbon inner so you just snip the fluorocarbon back as, as short or as long as you actually need your hinge section and then just tie your normal rigs with it so you can actually poke it through the inner braid and just cut it to get those flexible hinges and i've got an example here to show you uh, quite fashionable at the moment, Scott Lloyd's noodle rig. Um, this is actually tied up um, out of the Hydrolink Extreme. So when I talk about how stiff that is in terms of holding the hook up, if I just take the weight the hook length away, you can see that's happily propping up a size 5 with a fairly, side, fairly big chunk of putty uh, actually on the end of it. So you've got your flexible section um, at the hinge that's got the fluorocarbon stripped out of it. You can see how flexible that is in terms of how it moves. And then you've got a very, very, very stiff 
um, hook link material behind it. So when that lands, it will kick straight out from there and then it will lie with your little wafter hook bait sat just above your actual hook on the bottom. So it sits perfectly waiting for a carp to come along and snuffle that up nicely. Here we are, another Raysbury South 20. Just caught on a, a little multi rig with a pink pop up on the skinful. Another cracking looking fish. It's a typical stamp of what they are in here. Absolute stunners. So that's it, the rods are all out on the spots. We're gonna sit back now, have a bit of food, something to eat, enjoy watching the stars, and uh, hopefully something's gonna happen this evening. The night passed and unfortunately, we all slept far too well. Hopefully we can bag another one. The team had a good day's fishing today with good sized fish caught all round. Everyone got the rods back on the spots and waited in anticipation for the next Raysbury carp to come along. Hello guys, I'm Ian from Rig and Roll. Thought I'd take a quick moment to run you through the rig that I'm using on this session. It has already done me a fish, so you never know, it might do the same for you. Nothing too complicated. Um, fluorocarbon D rig constructed from our Cam H2O hook link material and also hunchback hook. Uh, it's a size 6, that one. Uh, this material is a little bit special, don't know if you've seen it before, as you can see, perfectly straight. If you have a miscast or you think it doesn't quite land right, you reel it back in and your rig comes back in like that, nine times out of ten that would be going in the bin. But with the fluorocarbon that Rigmarole do, literally get a puller, either end of it, little tweak, and there you have it, perfectly good ready to go out again. As long as your hook's sharp, send it straight back out into the lake. Moving up from that, three full lead clips. I'm sure you've all seen these before. Um, they ditch the lead quicker than anything else on the market. Perfect in weedy or snaggy environments. Give them a go. And then last but not least, the three full rig tubing. Uh, 0.5 hole through the middle of it. Uh, stainless steel core with a braided outer. This is the brown color. Blends in lovely with the bottom. Um, yeah, what more can you want from a rig tubing? So that's the end of our Raysbury session. Uh, we've had an awesome time here. The Rigmarole boys have all really enjoyed it. It's been a great session, a few nice fish being caught. Uh, massive thanks to RK Leisure for letting us come on here, doing some filming and doing the things that we've done. Uh, I think anybody here that has a ticket to fish this place is a very lucky person. Amazing venue, amazing facilities. Thanks very much again, RK.